I recently had a problem with the OfficeJet Pro 8710. Uh, one of the cartridges was depleted, which was a yellow cartridge. And after it was depleted, it won't allow it to print at all, even if I was only printing in black, which 99% of the time I only print in black, as well as it wouldn't allow you to scan, which doesn't make sense because it has nothing to do with the printing. Anyways, I found on YouTube, on another YouTube uh, site, a guy, a guy had posted, but it was in a different language, but it ended up even with the language barrier, and it was pretty blurry too. I ended up uh, figuring it out. So here's how it goes, and here's how it, you would, you'll be able to correct that. What you want to do is make sure that the question mark only is up here, and then you press above it, below it, above it, above it. And then you'll come to an engineering menu. And what you want to do is press the service menu. Service menu, press OK. And then you scroll down the arrow until you come to reset menu. Okay, and then you scroll down until you partial, no, semi full. Sorry, it's blurry. You come up to the OOB reset. Then you want to press OK. And now the unit's going to shut down. So I'll pause a second. Okay, the unit's totally off, so what you want to do is turn it on. It'll go through a process, take a few minutes, and then you'll it'll come to the uh, setup menu, or ask you if you want to set up as well. I forget what it was, but where you'll enter your uh, the country, the the language, and the date and the time. But the date and the time was already in there. So I press English. You have stuck with English. Yes. USA. You're stuck in USA. Confirm. And it's, it already set to the date, so, so that was good. Continue. And at the time, same, the time is correct, so you don't have to change it. And now you'll see this. Continue setup. Yes, you want to continue setup. Now, Sorry, it's hard to hold this without it with him. Printer setup options. General setup. Okay. So now one or more of the cartridges installed are HP cartridges that have been previously used. Okay, so the, the indicated cartridges are low. You do not have to replace the cartridges now. HP recommends you do have replacements available when whatever. Just press OK. Touch continue to initiate the printing process. This will pick up to seven minutes. You can continue the setting up process during. Okay. All right, now this here, would you like periodic collection amount of data? I did know because I don't know if doing that will actually create uh, the problem of locking up the scan. So I just put, unchecked it. So I'll continue. And then later. And I'm just going to say initializing for a... It's going to be on 0% for a while. 
uh, then, but then it'll eventually go to, you know, up to 100%. And I'm going to end the video now, but in a few minutes, it will uh, print out a sheet of paper, uh, a test sheet, printed on both sides. And then after it's finished, uh, should be able to scan and print. All right, I hope uh, this helps everyone out. Thank you.